Good morning, Sound Squad. The Sunday vlog is back in full swing. Oh, it's been a minute, my friends. It's been a minute, it's been a minute, it's been a minute. And as always, guys, yes, I do this while I'm driving, but my eyes are always forward on the road, and I am not looking at the camera unless it's like a stoppage in traffic or for a quick check to make sure I'm still in focus like right now. So, yesterday we had the first snowfall in at least Long Island. I'm not all New York, but at least Long Island had the first snowfall yesterday. It snowed all day yesterday for the most part, but it's very like flurryish. So we got like a um, we got like an inch of snow, maybe a little bit, little bit less than that. I should have gone. Woof! I should have gone, guys. Now I'm gonna be stuck behind Grandma McGee, going 25 miles per hour, and it's gonna take me forever to get to where I gotta go, my friends. But uh, what was I lost my train of thought? All right. Oh yeah, so it snowed yesterday. It snowed like a solid, uh, what do you call it, inch, inch and a half, two inches, not even, I got a little, a little dust in that most, uh, to say the least, and, um, it's December, it's crazy, because Christmas is in, like, what's today, today's the 10th, two weeks, basically, is Christmas Eve, and then Christmas is on a Monday, and that is kind of wild how close Christmas is, my friends, um, I still gotta get gifts from my parents and whatnot. <laughs> Figure something out for them. But uh, so today's topic is gonna be for you guys. What do you do uh, on like for the well? What do you do for the holidays for those that don't celebrate Christmas? That celebrate something else like Kwanzaa or Hanukkah or some kind of other holiday that's coming in hot. What do you guys do for the holidays? Where do you go? And. Do you want a white Christmas? I'm pretty sure almost everybody does, but some people don't. So I don't remember the last time it was a white Christmas. I'm almost positive, for me at least, maybe a year or two ago, it was very recent. It was definitely the last Christmas or the Christmas before that. It was literally 65 degrees on Christmas Day, and that was absolutely crazy for me. Like When I picture Christmas, I picture like gray skies or snowing or like some kind of like weather going on, not a bright sunny day, I, I, I don't know, I, I'm pretty sure most of you guys will agree with me on that, but I'm almost positive it's always pictured as a snowy day, people want it to be a snowy day, of course, for those who celebrate in Florida and whatnot, so where it's nice and friggin' warm all year round, you're like, man, what are you talking about, it's always a bright sunny day, 85 degrees on Christmas, and that's so, that's weird to me, that's very weird to me, I never understand, like, I, it's just hard to comprehend, like, having Christmas and like 80 degrees like I thought about I don't know why but I thought about it was in California too because it was 95 degrees most days when I was there that guy just got crap on my windshield I was always like 95 degrees and I couldn't imagine like be like yup that's a normal Christmas 95 degrees good to go yup 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 um but yeah it's just so weird picturing like a warmth now cause like it's like 35 degrees here in New York I'm wearing a beanie cause if I like do my hair I'm looking, I'm looking weird right now, the purple glasses and the white beanie. I'm looking like a wannabe, uh, like a wannabe rapper trying to, th trying to, trying to, uh, sell his clothing line. I'm like, yeah, bro, I got the best beanies and the coolest glasses around. Check out my merch. It's, uh, Cool Guy McGee, the rapper. Link is down below in the, in the, in the, in the, in the, in the, in the description. But, um. Yeah, man, so it snowed yesterday. We got Christmas coming in hot, so what do I do for Christmas? I really don't do much. I've been having Italian Christmases the last couple of Christmases, and by that, I mean, meaning like, lasagna, chicken parmesan, like a nice little antipasto before that. Um, what are the Italian stuff? I make garlic bread. Oh, I love garlic bread. Don't get me started on garlic bread, man. It's my, it's my go friggin' soup. Uh, meatballs, I believe, as well. Uh, what else did we, be, were we eating recently last Christmas? I can't really remember last Christmas, to be honest with you. I don't know what I did. I really can't. I really don't remember because I don't do much because I don't have much family. So only my grandparents come over and then, like, we have dinner and that's basically it. So, like, it's kind of like one and done with it, with the food and whatnot. But we eat a lot of food. But, um... It's not really like a huge family celebration, but the day before Christmas Eve, 
I always go to my friend Sean's house because his parents are like my second family kind of thing. And his dad coached me in um in a high school hockey. He was one of my coaches. And we've been friends since high school. So I always go there for Christmas Eve. They always have people over, a lot of food as well. And they have um like Christmas movies running all day. Um, like uh, the Christmas story and things like that. You gotta show your oh yeah, blah blah blah. All, that, all those like old school classic Christmas movies. Um, so I go there. So what do you guys do on Christmas? Do you guys go out anywhere? Do you host Christmas? Do you want a white Christmas? Uh, that doesn't count for you guys to have warmth all year round. It must be nice. But uh, that's gonna conclude today's vlog, guys. Thanks for watching. As always, I'm Mr. Talon, your glorious talent squad. Uh, let me know in the comments down below what goes down for you, Christmas guys. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.